Okay guys, now I'm going to be showing you a time-lapse video of me modeling its bed so you can get a better idea of how UV mapping and how modeling for Minecraft animations work. So as you can see, some tech just need uh, an alpha channel. So this black area is um, an area we want to get rid of. So the alpha channel will help us do that. So Minecraft skin, uh, Minecraft textures already have an alpha channel included in a PNG format. So that's what allows you to add alphas. So let's enable uh, alpha, and let's get the. So we have to, I think, individually copy and paste this. Like, so we copy the color texture, copy it into the alpha format, and paste it. So now, as you can see, it's now got rid of that black area. So let's do the same for this one. So color and copy the same texture and then paste it here and it shall uh, fix that for us. Okay, I forgot to mention, when you're scaling um, the UV maps, you have to scale it in one go. If you say miss it like this, and you try and scale it back, it's gonna miss. You can see it's not perfectly um, UV maps. So you need to always scale it in one go like that, and perf it'll be perfectly UV map. So that was one thing I missed. And the next thing is, so once I, as you can see now, once I t um, properly UV map it, I, it's in the wrong direction. So how I change that, is I go into um, I go into transform UV UV commands and I mirror it on the U axis. So you click on that U mirror U and it'll switch it around. It'll be the same for mirror V. It'll switch around that and yeah, that's how you do that. And there we go, I modeled the bed. So if you have any questions, just leave them down below. And if you want a tutorial explaining further as to how UV mapping and everything works, just leave it down below as well. And yeah, thanks for watching and see you in the next tutorial.